Hi guys, welcome back to our weekly vlog. It's actually really late at night. I should to be 11, 11 p.m. Um, and it's, I think, Monday? Is it Monday? I don't know. <laughs> it, it should be Monday, I think. But I am eating some chicken soup that my mom made today. So good. This week is going to be very eventful. I have somewhere to go Wednesday. Kind of going to be like a road trip with me and my friend. And, um, and then it's actually answered prayer, what we're going to do Wednesday. The kids are in bed. They've been in bed for a while, actually. I came home around 9 and they totally knocked out there. We were with AJ and they were just kind of hanging out with him. And then we came home and they knocked. So I have my dress. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna show it to you guys, but in this vlog I'm gonna show you is the actual dress. So stay tuned for that. The soup is so good. I love when soups are so simple. So good. For last week's update, I actually show you guys like everything that I get for prom. So if you guys like to see like more like the haul types of videos, I will leave that link down below. You guys are in a salsa bottle. <laughs> You guys were like leaning on this and I want some of this. Hmm. I'm gonna put some in my soup. And stay tuned for the rest of the week. Okay guys, so I picked up the kids. It's the next day. I picked up Anthony, not the kids. I picked up Anthony. We picked up Anthony from school. And he did really good and I got some um, news in um, his folder that he's actually the end of his school is on the 12th which is like like two weeks from now not even probably it's on the 12th of this month i cannot believe it so that's that's whenever his school is done is finished and that's crazy he's done with preschool i don't know like isn't it crazy tony that you're done with preschool so he's gonna move into onto kindergarten yeah and, um, yeah, <laughs> and um, Leah's taking a nap and I also filmed a video for you guys today sorry buddy the update and Anthony have and I have just been tickling each other so it says that his last day of school is on May 12th and then I have another letter here that says dear parents you're having a graduation we're having a graduation. Yeah, you can. We are having a graduation ceremony on Tuesday, May 16th. And then it says where. I'm excited they're gonna give him a, ta a tassel to go home with. Um, but um, they have like their cap and gown, I think there. Um, I'm not too sure, but I'm excited. So his graduation for preschool is the 16th and my graduation for high school is the 18th. So that's like two days away. From each other and it's kind of emotional but I cannot believe it. it's coming to an awesome. end awesome, and guys. he thank you right. and he has been doing really good lately at school it's amazing he's been doing great Tonio is digging for worms Yo.
the camera died. The camera died, look. Oh, it says change battery pack. Well, it did say that, okay? I promise. I was filming a prom makeup look for you guys. I'm sorry for those of you who hate my ankles and my hair, but I'm just, I'm not good at filming sometimes, okay? So I'm gonna charge my battery for a little bit. And I am gonna go write in my journal a little prayer. And um, once that is done, I will go back and film. Um, but I'm just gonna write a little prayer in my journal since I've wanted to do that. Oh, get that paper and do it right there. Hi guys, so I am back from my little road trip um, and I we went on a little road trip. I had to go run and do an appointment or go and um, get my appointment done today that I had and so it was like an hour, it was like two, it was like two hours, two hours and like something minutes away from where I lived and or from where I live. Why can't I speak? <laughs> from where I live and so we went and my pastor's wife actually took us um, and took me why do I keep speaking like this okay my pastor's wife took me to the appointment um, and it was we were gonna go out and do some other things but like you guys saw in the videos and the clips it was just really really ugly outside it was like raining cold it's ugly and we literally spent the two hours just talking like we, we sat in the car and we talked about our whole life. Like, seriously, it was so much fun. Um, I think that's the best part of a road trip of with somebody that you love and um, can connect to. Like, we just talked and that's it. And we stopped and ate two times um, and we got my appointment done. It was so, so good. It was a great, great appointment. Um, and yeah but i didn't film anything because we were mostly sitting down in the car we left i we left around 12 and then my point was at 3 so we got there like right at 3 because we stopped to eat and then it finished like at 3 20. um so i finished like around that time and then we started driving back home and then we did a pit stop at walgreens and we started driving again and we did um, and we stopped to get something to like eat slash snack on and we went to the mexican place which you guys saw what i was eating um and i also ate an elote um which is a corn like on the cob with mayonnaise cheese and chile which is chili and um it was just really good um and so then we came home and now it's like seven something i need to run to the store and i need to grab I just want to go look around I try to go find my mom because she has um, the kiddos she has Anthony and Aaliyah and she usually is in her cell group today because it's Wednesday right it's Wednesday I think it's Wednesday at least um, and she usually has cell group and I went to the house where she usually has cell group at and there was nobody there so I went home and there was nobody there so I went to the other house that she would most likely be at for cell group because I think sometimes they rotate and nobody was there so I just came back home and I'm like well I might as well go do something I'm gonna go to the store and um, grab or see if I can grab something for myself or just look around so I won't be stuck here at the house I've been very sad today although it's been a good good day I've just been sad because um, I've just been thinking about my brother a lot um, and I feel so like 
empty and sad coming home. Um, and I don't want to be here right now. But I don't know. Like, I think since I'm accomplishing some things in my life, I think I just really want it. I really want him to be here. Yeah, I just, I just, I really want him to be here so I could talk to him about it and tell him because I know he would be very happy for me. And my graduation's coming up, my prom's coming up, and I really wish he was just here. And I passed, um, I was coming, I was going to the other person's house to check my mom was there um, and I passed the cemetery and it took so much in me not to go and the reason why I don't go to the cemetery at all the only the only time I went to the cemetery was whenever it was his one year anniversary to let the balloons go but I don't go to the cemetery because I don't believe that he's there anymore um, like of course like his body's there but I don't like to make myself sad if I'm sad, I like to go out and do something because I don't like feeling sad. Although I feel it a lot, and I think it's okay to feel sad. I feel like I would rather go do something else because I know that he doesn't want me. To, he didn't want me to be sad, and he didn't want me to sit there and just be depressed all the time. He wanted me to be happy. So I was just trying to do that, you guys. I know. You guys are probably tired of hearing me talk about my brother, but he was a little, he was such a good brother, like, he was such a good friend, and, um, I just really miss him, I really miss him, because he was a really good friend to me, and I could tell him everything, and I just miss him, really miss him. Okay guys, so I edited my, I'm editing two, well I edited one video, I'm editing another video. I did like a, a little interview and I did that one and then um, I did a makeup tutorial, a prom makeup tutorial for you guys yesterday and I am currently editing that one but that one's a little bit longer than the other one so it's harder. Okay, where's my prom dress? It's harder to... It's longer. It takes longer to edit. That's what I'm trying to say. But yesterday, my mom and my sister went out to go shopping. And they went to go grab. I told them, I was like, listen, I just need some really simple, nude, cheap heels. That's all I'm asking for. If um, you guys find any, please get some for me. So they did. And they got really good ones. Um, I think it's going to match. I want to show you guys. Flash on so you guys can really see um, the heels. But this is my... This is my skirt, okay? So this is what the dress. And it does have a slit, like, like pretty high up. And um, that's why I'm I wanted these. They're cute, they're they're classy, and they're not going all out. So that's what they look like towards like right next to the dress. And I think they look perfect. Sorry about my white hand. I bought a new concealer today. And I wanted to try it out. So here's the top. So Let's see if I can fix this for you guys. And you guys can imagine it. Even though you guys probably already know what I look in it. So the top is right. Okay, I almost dropped the camera. But here's the top. Super pretty. And then the bottom. And then there's the heels. I think the heels will go are gonna go great. I like them. I like them. They're a little bit like they're a little bit a different color of the nude, but not too far off. I think they're fine. And these are nine West, and I got them at TJ Maxx for twenty nine for thirty dollars. I should probably take that off. I am. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm eating some wheat thins. I'm editing my video. I'm waiting for the kiddos to get home. It's late, but they went to go do something with them, and I'm stuck editing. And I really enjoy editing, so I might as well get it done and over with right now while I can and get it uploaded for you guys tonight because I love you guys um, I also want to tell you guys something that I was thinking um, so I was like today in the car like I was telling my my pastor's wife um, my pastor as we call her in Spanish um, I was like I feel really really bad because my mom did so much for me and 
I just didn't care. Like, I didn't care for what she did for me. And I felt so bad because of that, because she did so much for me and I just didn't care. And um, it saddened me. It made me feel sad. And also, like, you know, I regretted it. I felt really sad. And then my pastor, you know, she told me some comforting words. She gave me some great advice. But I remember I came home. I came home again and I was just really thinking that. I think I was just really beating myself up about it. And I was just like, you know, like, God, I'm really beating myself up over this and I feel really bad and, um, you know, and then God like whispered in my ear and he's like, change is the best gift that you can give to somebody. And it's so true. And he was just kind of like, she knows that you've changed and to her, what you did doesn't matter anymore as long as you're doing the right thing now and you're fixing yourself and then I wanted to cry but it was so true you know and we all stumble we all fall we're all ungrateful at one point but whenever we repent we regret it and we never go back instead we go bigger we get better I think that's whenever somebody says they've changed I can put the past behind me, I forgive them, I love them, and we're going to keep going, and we're going to do this, and I think that's so true, so hallelujah to the word of God today, what he's spoken to me today, so I just want to let you guys know that, I love you guys, don't ever forget that, he loves you more than I do, more than anybody can, just know that, put those down, Aaliyah. You guys, I don't know how I feel about today's look. I like slicked my hair back. How does it look? How does it look? Does it look good? It look good. I have a bunch of sores in my mouth. I don't know why I have so, so many sores, but it probably was a bad idea because I had sores yesterday, like in my mouth. And like I went to go eat that thing that you guys saw, the little like, I don't know what to say. It's like a chamango, I think that's what it was called. It's like a Mexican drink slash, I don't know. It's so weird to explain those kind of things, but I ate one of those and I'm pretty sure it was a bad idea because I like worsened. I woke up today and it was like my mouth hurt. Like my tongue hurts, the top of my mouth hurts. <laughs> it's just so short. I can't even eat because it hurts so bad. I tried to eat a banana today. It was literally torture. Torture. Horrible. They drank that whole Gatorade bottle by themselves. <laughs> She's like, yo, there's no more. Hey, cutie. Hey, cutie with a bow. She looks so cute, you guys. Sissy. Come here. So does Tonya. Look at him. He's so cute. Tonya brought home a plant today. That's what I was going to vlog. He brought home a plant that he planted at school. I did. If we can, whenever we plant the, the our garden, yeah, mm -hmm. plant our garden, we can plant it right behind a tree, right? Mhm. Mm yeah. Right in front yeah, of. Yeah, we can house. plant it. Let me see. Let me show him because it's so pretty. Oh and it has Look how pretty it is, you guys. It has a troll. Oh, I get it. I get it. That's his hair. Yeah. The grass is supposed to be the, the thing's hair. Yeah. I get it. There you go. Does it tickle? Let me see. Does it tickle your nose? <laughs> Does, it see? Does it tickle your nose? <laughs> Are you scared of the cow, you guys? I never seen a real cow, mommy. I never seen a real cow. That's not a real cow, honey. Oh, that's a pretend cow. A man just what? Who's that, Sissy? Mm. Who's that? Mm. Who's that? Mm. Who's that? Cow. Mm. The cow? Yeah. Is that a cow? Yeah. Don't be scared. Yeah. yeah. Leah loves her fries. Go, Leah. Go, Leah. Go, Leah. Go, Leah. Guys, <laughs> 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 okay, so look how I found her. Leah, look at her. She's so cute. Hello, guys. Uh, I have really bad allergies right now, and if you guys can see, like, 
I have like a red eye. We are at a post office right now. Mom's getting her passport. And we're just waiting inside the car. I really have to go potty though. I really, really, really have to go potty. There's Anthony John. Elias hi. reading. Oh, he's right there. You saying hi? Yeah. yeah. Hi, baby. I'm falling back. Hi. Ouch. I'm falling Ouch. Back. Ouch. Garage sailing. Look at my handsome boy. He's so handsome. Leah is back here taking a nap. We went to Sam's Club and got some things that we needed to grab, like toilet paper and things like that. But now we're just. We're just trying to see garage sales and see how they're going. They're really expensive though. Like people are ridiculous when it comes to garage sales. Like there's like 10, like things like, I didn't think a garage sale could be like over $10, but these people be like $10 for a pillowcase, like $15 for a stroller. Like girl, calm down. Does that not bother like anybody else? That bothers me. Whenever I go to a garage sale, everything's like 10, 15, 20 bucks. Like I've had a garage sale of like pretty good things, but I give everything, like all the clothes I give for like a dollar. I don't even care what it is. I'm trying to get rid of it. I'm not trying to make money out of it. I'm trying to get rid of it. And I sell it for like a dollar, all of it, no matter what it is. And then now if it's something like stroller, I sell it for like $5 or $10. Like you're just trying to get rid of your stuff. I don't understand why people like are so expensive. Am I the only one that thinks like that? Because I think, I think like it's ridiculous. I'm sorry that you paid $200 for a pillowcase, but you're trying to get rid of it. What do you mean $10? Anthony, don't do that. You guys, I have to do somebody's, one of my friends of makeup, one of my sister's friends, but she's also my friend makeup today just to do like a test run. I think she's just really skeptical. She's one of those people that doesn't wear makeup and she's beautiful without it. She's so, what's that? Knock it off! So you knock it off, you little clown! Knock it off, you little clown! My mom needed to run a few more errands, and I'm like, Mom, just take me home. I'm so tired. I'm like so tired of going out. I was just, I was just tired all in all. So I was like, Please take me home. I was like, Please. So we found that. Yeah. So we went to like four garage sales, and all we got was stuff for Anthony and Aaliyah to play with. Um. Okay, honey, that's enough. Yeah. Yep. So. Um, I'm like, mom, I have to go home. I'm just tired, so I, she took me home. Plus, we went shopping, and um, the car that we took was, we have like a little Chevy Cruze car, um, and we went with that to Sam's Club, and you know, everything in Sam's Club is so bulky. I don't I don't think we thought it out right, and like, I, we were stuffed in the car, and I was like, I can't deal with this. Like, I feel bad for the kids. I can't really be comfortable, so I was like, I was just, mom, take me home so I can drop this stuff off. And plus, it's really stressful going out with the kids on their own. They did really good, though, although I'm like constantly having to get on to them. They did good, but um, I was just tired. <laughs> I was just tired of doing all that. So we came back home. I have to go. I have to clean up because she's going to come. Um, I really want to. Not right now. She's. Um, like I said, my friend and my sister's friend is going to come. And I'm going to do a test run. Like I was saying, did I finish saying what I was saying? I don't know if I finished saying. But she was, she's beautiful without makeup. And so uh, I feel like whenever people that, whenever people ask me to do their makeup and they ask for a very natural look, it's very hard. It's very confusing for them because, ooh, the sun just went down. Or and, um, It's very confusing for them because they want a natural look. But if you're going to do a natural look with makeup on prom day, you have to do like a whole face of makeup. Just to make it look natural and not all out. I don't know if that makes any sense. It's hard explaining it to them and they kind of get skeptical. They're like, oh, well, um, I don't know if I'm really going to like that. Like, I want minimal makeup. And I'm like, well, you see, for it to all work out, for it to all come together, you have to put on a full face of makeup and make it just look natural in a sort of way because like for example if i just put concealer on her um then whenever she takes a picture it'll be like may like you could you would be definitely be able to see it just like the concealer under her eyes or if i just do like one thing and don't do the other thing it's gonna look a little off so i'm like try i was like trying to explain it to her 
or I was I, I tried to explain that to those to the people who come in like come in and be like oh well, I want to look as natural as possible for my wedding for prom for a party and I'm just like well in order for you to look natural I know that you don't definitely don't want to feel like a cake face that day there's the aftermath of what just went down you guys it was also clean and now it's also dirty. I just did my friends at makeup. Woo -hoo, woo -hoo, woo -hoo. I know, I think it's because it's bent. Good morning, guys. Good morning, guys. We're all just, Leah's eating a little bit of banana. Um, and I just wanted to show you guys what I did last night. Last night, we were like the last minute things. I don't know why my family likes to do that. Or why I like to do that. I like to do last minute things. <laughs> And I think everyone has last minute things to do, but. Okay, so I wanna show you guys my nails, and it's the color that I always use. I tried like three different colors, and I didn't like any of them besides the one that I always use. I also wanna show you something else. So, oh. These are my nails, they're just like a pinky mauve color. And this is a nail polish, and it's called 311 so much fun and then we made this last night and it's a corsage I guess it's called and then we just made it by hand because well we I said we, my mom made it isn't it so pretty it's lovely it's mom and so this goes on my arm or my hand on my wrist I should say like this it is so pretty you guys I have such like a perfect mother like literally she's so perfect to me all the me time too. Oh. you said me too like she made this for me and it's so cute the ribbon on it is a little um what's it called light blue it's like more of a blue I need I need a more like a toned down blue but I think it's perfectly fine I love it anyways it's perfect I don't think it needs to match perfectly and it's really pretty so I really like it okay I am finally getting started on my makeup you guys I'm just gonna put you guys right here I hope you guys don't mind being right there it's like almost five o'clock in the afternoon and I finished doing my sister's makeup and my her friend's makeup and it was a long day my legs hurt so now it's my turn okay I ended up taking off my nail polish because I didn't like how my nails looked. I felt like I needed to file them like down a little bit, so I did, and I just ended up taking it all off. So I took that off. I would repaint them again, but I feel like it's too girl. So it's too late to repaint them, you know.
I thought they did. Okay, guys, so my sister's trying to fix. I can't. Okay, whatever. Hold on. She's trying to fix my zipper because my zipper won't. It keeps coming down. And then all on its own, but I'm just. I did the makeup look that I did on. I don't know when I did. Hey guys, we're on the way, on our way to Prague. <clears throat> I don't think so. Hi guys. Okay guys, so that is it for this weekly vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it and if you guys did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. This one's a little bit longer than all the other ones, but that's because I had a little bit more of things going on. But if you guys enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. I'm editing and I'm, I'm going to be uploading it today, so excuse. It's a little bit late, um, but it has it was a lot. It was a lot to edit and um, I have, I've been busy. I've been busy, which you guys will see next week. So thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys. And don't forget, you guys, don't forget to follow us on our social media apps. Okay, social media apps follow us on there um, because I give you guys like a little bit more updates um, about everything you guys will just see pictures like if you guys follow me before you guys will see more prom pictures on there um, so go follow me on there they're all linked down below and if you guys follow me on snapchat I snapchat quite a bit but I do have a beautiful day so that's it don't forget to subscribe if you haven't and click the notification bell I love you guys so much bye, bye. what Oh my god, so cute! Oh, put it on your face. You got it? Yeah. The booker?